Ah, uh, Windows XP, a beautiful- don't interrupt me. A beautiful operating system that I grew up with in elementary school, all the computers in the library were using this operating system, even until I left uh, elementary school, which was uh, 2017. We're gonna see what, a, what you can still do with Windows XP, you know, after support's been discontinued for over 10 years, almost 11 years, so we're gonna go to start menu here, Internet Explorer, let's see if we can go to google.com. Alright, yeah, we can go to Google. Let's see if we can download a new browser because uh, Internet Explorer is not going to be our best bet for this. I'm just going to be completely honest. Yep. Oh. Oh. That's a... Uh, that's a problem. Well, that's a... Uh, that's that's a problem. Well, we could, uh... We could, uh... uh, uh can we, can we do, uh... Can we do archive.org? No, we cannot. Okay, okay. Um, this is already off to a bad start. This is already off to a terrible start. Oh, uh, you know what? Let's let's not do any internet things for now. Let's actually just go to some of the games, all programs, games. We gotta get that 3D pinball space cadet, man. There we go. Oh yeah. Damn. 543,000. That's enough pinball. Let's go back to the internet. See if we can figure something out. Uh, Opera. Opera's gotta be a good... Oh. No? Okay, that's... Bing! Why is it Bing? No wonder why it wasn't loading very good. Okay, that still didn't do anything. Soft tonic? Hell yeah! Oh no. Browsers for Windows XP. Yeah, I had a feeling that wouldn't work. None of these websites work. I can't. I literally cannot. Okay, what if I change the date and time in Windows? This might be a terrible idea. Let's go to February 10th, 2014. Okay, so it is now February 2014. Let's see if we can now reload. Okay, no. Well, I didn't fix anything, so internet stuff is kind of just out of the question. Okay, well, if we can't do anything internet related, let's just draw something at this point. Because there's nothing we can really do besides draw. We can't access websites, we can't really do much of anything, really. So let's just go ahead and uh, draw a picture. And then what we can do is use our uh, fill bucket tool and just uh, just start filling in random spots because that's, that's what a lot of people used to do on paint. Scribble and then fill a whole bunch of random squares or whatever they did with uh, just random colors. Alright, let's switch colors. Let's switch to uh, this. Oh yeah. Oh, we are making a masterpiece right here, bro. Yeah, we gotta get some red in here, too. Alright, now that, 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 that looks like a good art piece, so I think that's great. Um, yeah, sure, we'll, we'll save that. Uh, I think to end off this video, I'm gonna look up a wallpaper that I can set. So we're just gonna go ahead and uh, look up something like uh, Nirvana wallpaper. Well, I don't think we can actually zoom into it, so we're just gonna save picture as as that. Yeah. All right. We're gonna minimize that. We're gonna go here. My documents. Uh here yeah and we're gonna set it as desktop background okay it automatically did tiled and we don't want that so what we're gonna do is we're gonna open with uh open with paint right oh all right so we're gonna we're gonna use our select tool we're gonna select it we're gonna make it bigger all right and then and we're gonna make it smaller and we're gonna make it bigger again. Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yes, yeah. 
boom. All right, now we're gonna set that as the desktop background. Oh yeah. Now that is the authentic Windows XP experience. I'm sorry I couldn't really do much. I could only use Google and that's about it. Uh, if you guys have a way to help me get on the internet or anything, uh, please let me know in the comments below. Thank you guys for watching this video. If you have enjoyed it and you want to see more stuff like this, make sure to leave a like. Maybe even subscribe if you're new. And I'll see you guys in the next one.